What's going on guys? In this video, I'm going to be talking about GB145 and uh, whether the balls do anything or not. So people probably will say that, uh, or uneducated people will probably say after watching the anime that the balls, when this is spinning, will provide some crazy good stamina or defense or whatever to make the Beyblade spin faster. That is not true in the slightest. Come on guys. The uh, outward weight distribution is not nearly good enough for it to uh, affect a uh, spin. And then the shape of it is also just not good for stamina so or, or defense, for that a matter of fact. One thing that this track does do very good, though, making it competitively viable, is it's very heavy. Uh, it's one of the heaviest tracks, uh, 145 height tracks. Um, that's not a disc track. So one of the heaviest tracks that's, in, uh, that's legal in Metal Fight Limited. So, I actually don't see this track used very much in Metal Fight Limited uh, on attack, just because, you know, there, there's tracks like H145, R145 that just do um, everything but better. But one combo I do see this used on is actually Gravity Perseus with Circle Flat. And that combo basically just wants to be heavy, and this helps it out. And, man, I am not able to hold on to these these tracks today. But, um, yeah, this track is just, it's really good for being heavy. It lines up really well with Flash, too. Um, it's just an, uh, an oval. But, yeah, I just want to make sure you guys know that this doesn't actually provide good stamina or a good defense. Because 145 height defense in Limited is cursed. And if you use it, that's, uh, that's wild to me. But... Yeah, if you want to use it, go ahead. This track is a definitely a good track and something you probably want for Metal Fight. But yeah, just keep in mind that the uses for this is a lot more limited than uh, what you probably thought. And it really shines on attack types and things that need weight. So yeah, 